Good afternoon and welcome to another episode of What's Jamie Up To? Today I'm at the allotment. Oh look at that tunnel that's coming down. And I have a quick hour to kill before I have to pick the kids up. So I'm going to tidy this bed up here. This was my parsnip bed and I had a small netted tunnel here with carrots in but the netted tunnel as you can see it's knackered so that's got to go as well and the carrots didn't really do much and in the middle I had some spring onions but I forgot to cover those and the rabbits ate absolutely everything hopefully I've plugged all the holes in the in the fence in the in the metal fence I've got this around the perimeter uh, all over there as well and at the top here Hopefully, I've plugged all the gaps so no rabbits can get in. So, let's get tidying. Right, an hour and 20 minutes later, the bed's cleared and dug over. There's a lot of root in this bed. There's a lot of cooch grass, and there is a lot of bindweed. We're plagued with bindweed on this site. I'll never get it all out, and I'll be forever weeding, and there's no fun in that. So I'll just try and get as much out as I can. That's what it's all about on the allotment. Little jobs, little and often. The other day I did the tunnels. Today I did this. Tomorrow I'll cut the grass. I'll weed round the apple trees and the gooseberry bushes and along the back here. Um, I may take that tunnel down because it's that pipe's no good unless you support the top of it, which I didn't do. Uh, and then I need to get on and weed the, the main beds. And then I'll look at, once I've got this one round, I'll then look at the second plot. You can see the artichokes growing there. I've got some compost beds to build along the back there. I've not, I only took this one on last year and I haven't really done anything with it. I did find an already established asparagus bed over there somewhere. And I'm waiting for that to grow. There's no sign of it yet. And there's an old grapevine that needs cutting down as well. Okay, that'll do for today's instalment. I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. It's a little past half eight on a Sunday morning. The first job of the day is to clear out one of the compost bays because I'm gonna to top this bed up a bit. So, Project allotment rejuvenation is well underway. I think I've been here every day this week. So once I've topped this up, the next job is to remove that knackered old tunnel. Hi, it's actually Monday. I didn't do much filming yesterday. There was a lot of people about. So I just got on with the jobs really. So I've started clearing out one of the compost bays um, and topping up. I topped up this bed that we weeded and I've planted some seeds in here. Uh, in this first row, I have planted some carrots, Autumn King. Um, I'll do one row, then in a couple of weeks, I shall do another row in the middle. I've done half a row of spring onions here, and then in a couple of weeks, I'll do another half a row. I've done a row of parsnips here as well. Poppy's just gone to get the watering cans, so she'll water here. I can always do a second row of parsnips or carrots if I need to. Um, I've trimmed up and cleared round the base of the apple trees. Me and Poppy actually grew these from seed from an apple we got from the supermarket. Um, a pink lady apple which are the girls favourites. I don't think they'll come as pink lady apples but we're just going to see what happens with them. Um, cleared up round the bottom of the gooseberry bushes cleared along the back sorted out a bit of fencing there was a little hole at the bottom there so I've plugged that well I've swapped the panel round so hopefully no more rabbits I haven't seen any for a couple of days um, I've took down the tunnel that fell over I've just plopped it all there for now where the leaks were because it was a it did the job I suppose but Oh well, it's not as good as the other tunnels, but I'll tell you about that a bit later. 
Um, I had a barrow full of soil left over, so I've popped it here because it was it was a bit of a, a pothole here, I should say. So the grass will soon grow through that. Everything's growing okay in the tunnels. I won't show you those. There's nothing, nothing new in there really. Just the leaks and you know from the other videos. The rhubarb's not really doing much. We do get quite a lot off it, but maybe it's still too early. I don't know. Let's have a quick look in the greenhouse. This will be the tomato house. My wonderful mother-in-law is dropping off some tomato plants this week. So they shall go in there. Okay. We've had a breakthrough. We've had only overnight these have popped up. This is the radish. So once they're a bit more established, we'll thin those out. I planted some fennel for some fennel bulbs um, and some dwarf green beans in there yesterday. Um, nothing else really. The peas aren't really shooting up in this piece of guttering. Uh, and the onions aren't really doing a lot either. We only planted them the other day and the corn's not up yet. And the mice haven't triggered the traps. So I'm hoping they're staying away. Okay, I'll get Poppy to water in here and I'll see you back in a bit. We just planted up some sweet pointed peppers and we planted up a lettuce mix in there. Poppy wanted to grow some salad. So I planted that in the greenhouse today. It's a lovely sunny day, so these shouldn't take too long to germinate. Right, now on to the next project. Well, I don't think we're gonna do anything. I'll just show you what we're gonna do the next time we come up. So I'm off work tomorrow. And my plan is to come here after the school run and dig over these beds and get them ready for planting. I may cover them over. I may even cut the grass. I should have done that yesterday, but I didn't bother. Um, and I'll find a home for all this, probably at the back of the shed. The ground's so dry, we haven't had any rain for a, quite a while now. So I don't know. I may leave it till we've had some rain. I did start trimming back the uh, the grapevines. There's about three or four over there. So once I get a pile together, because I need to trim some more of that. Once I get a pile together, I'll have a fire. Okay, thanks for watching. I'm waiting for the next video to see what's Jamie up to.